Amer <laughs> American discount. Hey guys, it's Crystal here, and today I'm going to be doing an after Christmas shopping haul, and I might title it What I Got for Christmas 2015, but it's an after Christmas shopping haul because what I got for Christmas, I'll just give you a rundown really quickly. I got a laptop, and I'm so grateful for that from my parents, and I feel like I sound like every other YouTuber in the world, but I mean, how could I not be? I'm so thankful for my parents, to my parents for that. And then, I got a sweater for my brother's girlfriend, but that's not in this video because that's downstairs. And I got Alessia car tickets for my bro. Yes, gratefulness. Yes, because like, she's my mother. <laughs> and I'm so excited for that. It's gonna be great, and it's my birthday weekend, yay. And then, um, I got money. So, with the money, I went shopping on December 26th with my friend Carmel in San Francisco. So, I went to American Eagle, Finish Line, and PacSun. I went super duper overboard at PacSun, but a lot of these clothes are gonna be in a lookbook coming at you January 7th, hopefully. So, that will be kinda cool. And, um, uh, disclaimer, my voice is all over the place. It has been for the past few days, so, you know, bear with me. So, in San Francisco, if you want a bag, you gotta pay 10 cents, which is not horrible, and I think it's good because it encourages people to get their own bags. But, all day, this Paxton bag did not survive. So, all, so all of the clothes have transferred to this American Eagle bag. From American Eagle, I got three things. American Eagle offers military discount, and my dad's in the military, so I got to use that. So grateful. Um, but yeah, so the jeans were buy one, going half off, so I got a pair of high-waisted black jeans, because everyone knows that um, you only get black jeans like once, and then you'll wash them, and then you get charcoal jeans, so you know, never have enough of those. And then I had a pair of light wash jeans like this, except they were like a more light bluish color. I got another pair because I pull up my pants using the belt loops and the belt loop ripped and it was really awkward because it's the back one. So I got some more even though I still wear those ones. Because American Eagle jeans just fit me really really well. Like Hollister ones used to but they changed like their jean formula and now they just don't. And then their clearance was 50% off the tagged price. So I just grabbed this Phoenix sweater and it's um drop shoulder with ribbed sleeves and the sleeves are really skinny so like it might that make me feel cool and the uh, um i have i have like huge collarbones so like i like to show them off every once in a while it has like a wide v-neck that doesn't show like so that's good so next is pack sun and this is like so those are the two those are the only two clothing stores i went to so yeah pack sun was buy one get one 50 percent off but then it was buy one get one free like Denim, sweaters, sweatshirts, cardigans, hoodies, all that, jackets and stuff, but I didn't get any of those things, so I got buy one, get one half off, excluding Brandy Melville, which was horrible, and I didn't make it all the way to Brandy in San Francisco, but, you know, I still grabbed something, because, you know, I did. So, since I already mentioned it, I may as well just show you what I got from Brandy. It is this vertical stripe baseball tee dress it's a dress but i might end up wearing it with leggings thanks dad so um hopefully these vertical stripes will make me look taller so tall that i could walk all the way into a victoria's secret model fashion show audition and fool them no i'm too short for that okay i like am obsessed with these like button up skirts even though this one isn't like it's like the snap buttons which make me feel a little but this is from the Kendall and Kylie Jenner collection and I really like it because I don't have a black one. I have a dark blue one from Hollister. That one's a little more like vintage, cutesy, and this one's a little bit more like I'm Kylie Jenner and I'm cool. So, you know. Kang from Paxon in San Francisco. If you ever see this YouTube video, you are the bomb.com. Like the Paxon workers, like actually all, like most of them are pretty cool in San Francisco and like they make me want to work at Paxson even though the nearest one is in Backville and it's not the San Francisco one so it would be a whole different like vibe. I still want to work at Paxson. I got this. He recommended it. His name's Kang. Um, he recommended it. It's ribbed. 
and it's got little stripes on it. It's maroon, it's long sleeve, it's tight, but not like, doesn't give you like a boob sack. So that's nice. And then I got this um, Vans, like, retro -y. Is it retro? Okay, I don't know. But, um, it's, like, oversized and cropped. But I tried on the small. This is an extra small. It was huge. Not huge. It was still, like, cropped-y. But, you know, it was just, like, if you took a large shirt and then cropped it. So I grabbed an extra small. And then I got this, um, it's a raglan baseball tee, whatever. I tried on the black one, and it was see-through. I mean, it's the same material. It's like a lighter material, and I don't doubt that this one's gonna be see-through too. Just wear an undershirt with it, or a bandeau, but most likely an undershirt. Um, but my friend convinced me to get the green one because I don't have a lot of green in my closet because I feel like it'll make me look like a tree. But anyways, the last things I got from Paxson, I got these two flannels, and I love flannels, and um, I got them in smalls, and they fit perfectly, which I was not a fan of. I wanted to medium so we went back and I got a medium in this color because I don't have this color because I don't like to wear green but this color is so cool because it has mustard in it and blue and I love those two colors but yeah so I exchanged it and got a medium and then this one I didn't see the whole other rack of maroon so they didn't have a medium in the rack that I looked in fail and then I went to Urban Outfitters I forgot to mention that in the opening because I only got two things and one of them's not even clothes. Got these socks, these over the knee socks, and I have a brand new Hill sweater that like matches perfectly, but I probably won't match them. But they're over the knee, and they were actually five dollars because it was two for ten, and then my friend got one, and I got one, so it was five. And then I got this journal because I am going to journal 2016. This year, I'm gonna go from January to December 31st. Yes, goals. Okay, my goals video is coming out next week. Anyways, last but not least, finish line. And you can probably already guess what I got because I'm the most mainstream person in the entire world. But you know what? Mainstream's a new hipster. I've been looking for these since June, so don't even, like, give me sass in the comments about being, like, basic. No. I was looking and looking and looking, but a size 8 in men's is not the easiest thing to find in the entire world. And I feel a little bit attacked and up and neglected that they stopped making the women's versions but you know it's fine it's fine so finish line gives um 20 percent off but let's have story time real fast walk in carmel goes hey do you guys have the um white um adidas all-stars and she was like the only size we have left is the one and a half and so we were like oh okay so we walk out and she's like unless you're men's and i was like oh yeah um do you have, and she was like, oh, okay, what size? And I'm like, eight. And then she goes to check. She's gone for a really long time. Comes back. It's our last pair. And I was like, oh, please. So they're a little big, but the seven is too small. So I can always wear double socks. Ooh, oh, that's kind of disgusting. Yes, I got Adidas All-Stars. Er, Oh, what are you wearing? Converse and Adidas mashup? No. So I got Adidas Silver Stars. And, um, yeah. They've got some, like, arch support. Some ankle, or not. Some heel thingy, my bobbers. So that is it for this video. My favorite song this week is, um, December by, um, Ariana Grande. Polarized by... 21 pilots. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. I love you guys so much. Now, hey, eat pizza, and I will see your lovely faces later. Okay, bye.